What's going on guys? Um, I just wanted to make this video right quick. Hi my friend. Um, just wanted to make this video real quick and um, just to show you this area I'm staying in. Um, this is my first hotel that I'm staying at uh, here in Lahore. Uh, it's right on the main road as you can hear the traffic. Um, this is the outside and I'm going to walk you guys inside. I'm going to show you how the hotel looks like but this is how it looks like outside. This road is called Lawrence Road. It's here in this area called Gilbert Hotel. Um, Gilbert, the place, the area is called Gilbert. And if you know Lahore, there's a roundabout at the end of the day where there's an airplane. And then you come through here, it's called um, Lawrence Road. There's a few hotels down here. There's Imperial next to, next to it. And there's the Hayat. And there's another hotel right next to it. I forgot the name. But this is the road as you can see. As you come in, this is the entrance right here. This is the entrance. They lift it for you if you're driving in or whatever and i believe the car park is down there and this is the hotel the name of the hotel is right there it's called saffron door hotel and yeah this is how it looks like this is the building as you can see okay so it's got seven floors as you can see but on the seventh floor there's a there's a restaurant for the hotel so this is the main entrance here as you you know you come in this is what you see as you reach they keep it very clean outside as you can see they just finished cleaning and they got people opening the door for you always thank you my friend how are you so as you come in this is the chilling area as you can see right here what you could call the lobby and that's the reception right here it's another sitting area here as you can see very spacious it's very clean as well and on this side as well beautiful flower piece as you can see and there's two there's two lifts you can take that lift or you can take another lift over here near the main entrance which i'm gonna take it's closer to my to my room all right there's a bar area over here you can come and buy some drinks all right so this is the lift perfect all right so as you come in the lift as you can see it's very clear beautifully designed as well staying on the fifth floor okay this is how the lift looks like. All right, let's close the door. Actually, no. close the door, go off your floor. Okay, so this is the lift, as you can see. Um, yeah, the thing, the only thing about the lift is it's not spacious. As you can see, the hand that's holding the camera is literally on the actually wall right here. And then this is on the other side as well. So you can't even open up, open up your arms fully, but it does the job. And what I really like about this this place is that they put some nice little incense in the, in the lift to keep it smelling really fresh. And as you come out the lift, this is what you see. I'm on the fifth floor, as you can see. The first room is 501. And this is the corridor right here. Nice carpet. These people always stay cleaning. Um, not too many lights. It's a bit dark, as you can see. They're doing more cleaning out here. And your boy's room is right here. This is my room right here. My friend, why is it so dark here? Yeah. Where's five the lights? Five, uh, five zero five. Why is the lights? Lights. Lights. Room lights. No, no. Corridor lights. Yeah, corridor lights. Why is it oh. so dark? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. There we go. So you put the lights on. Okay. A bit more, more lights as you can see. So that's the corridor. That's how it looks like. Okay. Very clean hotel. And this is my room right here. I don't know if you can see the number, but it's 501. There you go. Okay, so let's go in. Let me put the key card in there and the lights come on. Um, I already made a video fully about this room as I came in when I checked in the other day, but you know, um, let me just show you guys this again. So this is how it looks like in the room. So again, what comes with the room, as you can see, there's a seat over here. Uh, leg rest right here matching the seat uh, table little table over here under the flat screen TV wardrobe in the corner and uh, my suitcase is there on some little table there as well uh, another little table which is like a little drawer kind of thing on the side of the bed over there I pulled out to put my laptop on there another one on that side over here over there and this is the bed where the magic happens yeah <laughs> no I'm joking no magic happening over here in Pakistan <laughs> and yeah so I spoke to you guys about the windows already so originally actually let me turn this around so guys originally when i checked into this hotel um 
they this this wasn't my original room when I checked into this hotel. They had given me a different room that um, had no windows, and I literally had to get on to the to them about why I had no windows in my room. And uh, yeah, so I had to ask them to move me to a different room. Um, but I spoke about all of that in a different video. So check that video out when I first arrived there in Lahore, my first day in Lahore. So I spoke about that. So yeah, they had given me a room with no windows, and uh, you know, I, I said to them, "Hey, what's going on?" They said, um, "The room I booked apparently on the website on Booking.com apparently the room I booked for I booked for a room you know that had no windows." I mean. Who does that right and i show them the proof that you know that wasn't the case the room i booked for and you know they didn't say nothing about the room not having windows so they ended up you know giving me this particular room and yeah so make sure um when you're you know booking rooms on websites make sure you get exactly what you book for uh, because these hotels some of them have the tendency of you know giving you some um different rooms so anyway this is the room right here tv over there on the wall and this is the bathroom over here as you see a huge mirror over here and yeah bathroom toilet and look guys something just happened to me a little while ago as i was taking a pee i was taking a pee so these pieces here on my shorts right here they're supposed the end bits have had some metal clippers on them so as you can see this one is missing guess what just happened a little while ago as i was over here taking the piss one of them just dropped off right in the you know in the toilet <laughs> and your boy is not really feeling i'm there's no way i'm putting my hand in there to you know to dig it out so it's gonna stay there it is what it is but yeah so this is the shower area over here a bit narrow but you know it's enough for one person big shower head as you can see keep clean make sure you wash yourself all right so guys this is the hotel i wanted to show you it's got seven floors and you're probably wondering how much am i paying for um this hotel you know i must say um out of all the hotels that i've stayed in here in pakistan so far this hotel here is probably the most expensive one um i've paid 120 for three days i'm gonna be here for three nights and actually tonight as i'm doing this video right here this is my last night um this is my last night here so tomorrow i'm checking out this hotel that's why i wanted to do this video for you guys before i actually leave but yeah a bit expensive um i don't know how much it works out per night but i've paid yeah you guys do the maths come on man um 120 uh divided by three so yeah that's how much i'm paying for this hotel so there's a next hotel, like I said earlier, when I was starting the video, there's a few hotels on this road. I'm going to go outside actually now and check out those hotels and see if I can check out some of their rooms. And if they do let me and I check them out, if I like them, because I've already checked them out on uh, on booking.com and they looked a bit, they look good, but I haven't been in there. So, and they're right next door. So yeah, I might as well go check them out personally. And if I like any of them, I'll probably, you know, book one of them and just move into one of them tomorrow and of course when i do i'll make a video about that and show it to you guys as well so this hotel here is called um the saffron door hotel as you can see right here on the pillow all right there now what do i have to say about this hotel well not too many complaints about this hotel actually as you saw when you come in here in when you come when you're walking in um uh, the guys are very you know kind um you know they're very professional there's always somebody to open the door for you at the main entrance and also at that barrier as you come in on the main road there's always somebody to lift it up for you if you're driving in so people are very professional here they keep you know the place very clean the service is amazing as well i've ordered food a few times here and these guys have always brought it up efficiently um yeah even yesterday i done some washing as well these clothes actually they wash them nicely and they iron them for me as well and obviously but that's not free that's not included in the price um breakfast is included but you know your boy never had never has breakfast i don't eat in the mornings um, i'm always sleeping in the morning so unless i'm going somewhere early early but i haven't had breakfast here i haven't tried the breakfast out so i don't know how it tastes like or what options they've got because i knew i wasn't going to be eating breakfast i'm always sleeping in those early hours of the morning and because in case you're wondering why 
I'm always staying up late editing videos. I find it peaceful to edit videos at night, you know, after midnight. So that's my thing. So anyway, I haven't tried, you know, the breakfast out, but I've also haven't ordered anything from their actually um, restaurant here. They've got a restaurant on the seventh floor. Um, I'm gonna see if I, sh I can actually go. And eh, well, I haven't eaten from there, so there's no point of me going up there and actually filming that. So yeah, if I've eaten from there, maybe I'll take you, I'll go up there and film it, but I haven't, so I don't know how it looks like. So if you ever stay in this hotel, check it out if you want to. But yeah, um, apart from that, what else? Yeah, the hotel was cool. Um, it's just that it's the most expensive hotel I've been in since I've been in. And also, the Wi-Fi is okay, I believe. Um, I haven't had no issues with it. Um, I don't know about the speeds. Well, I've just been using it on the laptop. And then it started messing up yesterday. So, I, you know, I put my stick back in there. My internet stick, as you can see. Yeah. Those internet sticks are very reliable, by the way. Um, I made a video about that already. They gave it to me when I got my SIM card when I first got here. So yeah, um, the internet was okay. I haven't uploaded a video from here yet. And when I was uploading videos, I was using my stick as well. So guys, this is the hotel. Um, yeah, here in Lahore, um, this area called Gilberg, I believe, on this road called Lawrence Road. Okay. Saffron Door Hotel here in Lahore. All right, guys. Wanted to show you the hotel. I'm sure I did that very well. And yeah, catch you in the next one. Subscribe, share, and like, and all of that good stuff. Pakistan's in the back.